just realize everybody is here to party. Oh, yeah. Greetings and welcome, fellow barium intimists, fluoroscopists, and cross table lateralists. I am your host, Ron Jones, and I am not a radiology technician. Nope, I'm a technologist, and I've been in this field long enough to know that just because you came into my emergency room at 2 a.m. with a chronic back pain times six years does not mean the x-ray should be stacked. This is the Radiologic Technologist Podcast for Rad Techs by Rad Techs. Thanks for listening. All right, we're back on the air. Again, this is Ron Jones on the Radiologic Technologist channel. I'm gonna ask another, or I'm gonna answer another question. This one's about six days old and I apologize. I'm gonna try to start answering these questions on Fridays. I think about them throughout the week and I do check almost daily on all these. You know, the problem is I get emails, I get questions left on the YouTube channel, on uh, Reddit, there's a great Reddit, subreddit called uh i think it's just called radiology lots of activity there anyway enough excuses i have a question on youtube uh, from a gentleman named mohammed who said i want to ask a question uh is the radiologic technologist or can they take courses uh or something postgraduate to become a radiologist now i think what your there's a couple of ways I can interpret that question. Um, first, let's just dispel any notion that you can jump from being a radiologic technologist to a radiologist just by taking a couple of uh, classes. That's not going to happen. Um, radiologic technologist is a two-year program. You can go into it with some programs with uh, no degree at all, come out with an associate's, and you're a practicing radiologic technologist. Uh, some require a bachelor's degree level uh, coursework. In order to become a radiologist or a doctor of radiology, um, you're gonna have to get into medical school. I mean, you're, you're talking 16 years, I think last time I looked, of school. Um, now, could you, you, know, you have to get your bachelor's degree first, a general bachelor's degree, and then you apply to medical school, which is four years. And then you do radiology internships and rotations and, and uh, subspecialties and all that stuff after that. So uh, could you get a bachelor's in radiology and use that bachelor's to get into a medical school? I'm going to say it's probably kind of tough because the bachelor's degree, the typical pre-med bachelor's degree is heavy duty on life sciences, heavy duty on uh, uh, anatomy and physiology, bio, uh, biology, I don't wanna say it's 101 and 201, there might've been a 202, um, microbiology, zoology, uh, physics, one and two, statistics. Um, when you're talking the bachelor's in uh, radiography, you're not going to get half of those. You're only going to get uh, AMP. You're going to get limited physics as it relates to radiography. Um, it's it's a much more specific or dialed in um, coursework. Uh, I mean, anatomy is anatomy, so that's pretty pretty broad uh, anywhere you go. Uh, but the physics is aimed at um, radiography physics, not general physics. Uh, and then, like I said, in a, in a, a pre-med bachelor's degree, you're going to get zoology and microbiology and a lot of those classes you're not going to get in a radiography program. So, um, but would it be awesome to be a, a rad tech before becoming a radiologist? I think it would be uh, really cool because you, you want to talk about knowing your stuff when you get into medical school, uh, when all the other uh, undergrads or graduates are learning about radiology, you will have already mastered the art of taking x-rays and obtaining x-rays and positioning and patient care and uh, techniques and all those things. So, um, and, and have I, I, I personally don't know any rad techs who became radiologists. I do know a sonographer who became an ER physician. 
And I do know uh, a nuclear medicine tech who became a DO. Um, so, I mean, you know, there are some people that go on to become physicians after being uh, uh, in, in the radiography or similar field, one of the advanced modalities. Um, but I, I, my senses tell me you're asking, can you, can you maybe just take a few more extra classes beyond x-ray tech to be a radiologist? And the answer is no. So um, I hope that answers your questions and I'll get this posted and reply to you here real quick. I hope you're able to see it. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so it gets a little more exposure. And if you have any more questions, leave them in the comment section. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna hate to commit to question and answer Q and A Fridays in case I can't get to it next Friday, but, uh, but I do enjoy answering the questions and I, I hope they're helpful. So uh, thanks for asking and uh, good luck. I just realized everybody is here to party.